when I set up Baker and Cook, I had a clear vision about building one of the world's leading artisan bakery and food stores. So for me, that wasn't just one or two shops. What I wanted to do was build a brand. And you know, we are a Singapore business. We're not from anywhere else other than Singapore. And Singapore is a, is a hub of greatness. And if you can survive here, the immediate countries around Singapore, they will welcome you in because you did well in Singapore. So being in Manila, being in KL, being in, in Saudi Arabia, in the Middle East, is because of the strength and the value that Singapore has given us. I'm David, and I'm the CEO of Pet Lovers Centre. We are currently in five countries, Singapore, Malaysia, Thailand, Vietnam, and the Philippines. We currently have greater than 130 stores in Asia. I always tell my entire team that you have to think global and act local. While we are going international, there will always be different challenges. So what I do is I identify people who may be very proficient in their area of expertise. I give them opportunities to work in Malaysia, Thailand, Vietnam for an example. This allows them to understand different cultures and give them tremendous opportunities to work in a different environment while we are growing them. Marcus has been working with me for a very long time. It really takes time for a staff to have, to understand what PLC means, to understand our processes, and very importantly, he or she must be able to be an exceptional performer. The second thing is not only must he perform well, he must have clear understanding of the brand. The third thing that I look for is someone with exceptional EQ. EQ is very important. We are, after all, working with international guys. That's one. We must be very sensitive to their ways of doing things, understanding and their culture. And very important that they are, after all, business owners. My name is Marcus. I'm the Business Development Manager for Pet Lover Centre. I travel extensively to all the countries within ASEAN to meet existing uh, business owners as well as to explore business opportunities. We live in a very diverse region with many differences in culture and legislation. So we have to have a lot of patience to explain our best practices so that they are able to understand and carry to the commercial benefits of both parties. EPS is a talent management company and currently we have eight offices in five countries including Singapore, Malaysia, Thailand, Philippines and Japan. During our course of business, um, we noticed that many of our clients are actually looking at internationalisation but they are also facing challenges such as having the right talent to assist them. So with our experience in engaging interns to assist us in our own overseas office setup, we now also launch this service of deploying interns of different nationalities to our client to actually help them in their internationalisation. Internationalisation is a way of life. It requires mindset change. So many of our young talent should learn about internationalisation from young. We match them to the senior internationalizers so that there is a role model to follow. And at the same time, they can help the older generation look at the world of the future. Skills Future Singapore and ITI have jointly developed the iTalent Map to help companies nurture the talent, to help them internationalise. One of the most differentiating factors of this framework is that it has been developed by people who have successfully undertaken internationalisation.